Hi, hello, I'm Kanata. Welcome to the second episode of Bedtime with Kanata. I was just enjoying some peace and quiet. Are you feeling peaceful, comfortable, and ready for a bedtime story? Oh, great, because tonight's story is called Peace at Last and is by Jill Murphy. The hour was late. Mr. Bear was tired. Mrs. Bear was tired. And Baby Bear was tired. So they all went to bed. Mrs. Bear fell asleep. Mr. Bear didn't. Mrs. Bear began to snore. Snore! Would Mrs. Bear snore, snore, snore. Oh no! said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in Baby Bear's room. Baby Bear was not asleep either. He is lying in bed, pretending to be an airplane. Meow! Went Baby Bear. Meow! Meow! Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the living room. Tick tock, went the living room clock. said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he went off to sleep in the kitchen. Drip, drip, went the leaky kitchen tap. Mmm, went the refrigerator. Oh no, said Mrs. Bear. Oh, Mr. Bear, can't stand this. So he got up and went to sleep in the garden. Well, you would not believe what noises there are in the garden at night. Twit, twit. Went the owl. <laughs> Went the hedgehog. Meow. Sang the cats on the wall. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So off he went to sleep in the car. It was cold in the car and uncomfortable, but Mr. Bear was so tired that he didn't notice. He was just falling asleep when all the birds started to sing and the sun peeped in at the window. Tweet! Tweet! went the birds. Shine, shine, went the sun. Oh no, said Mr. Bear. I can't stand this. So he got up and went back to the house. In the house, Baby Bear was fast asleep. And Mrs. Bear had turned over and she wasn't snoring anymore. Mr. Bear got into his bed and closed his eyes. Peace at last, he said to himself. <coughs> Went the alarm clock. <coughs> Mrs. Bear sat up and up her eyes. Good morning, dear, she said. Did you sleep well? Not really well, dear, yelled Mr. Bear. Never mind, said Mr. Bear. I'll bring you a nice cup of tea. And she did. The end. And this story is called Peace at Last. Oh, poor old Mr. Bear. <laughs> Didn't get much sleep at all, did he? I hope you will sleep peacefully tonight. And Hi Ali is going to sing Lavender's Blue for you. Get cosy. Now I'll see you soon for another bedtime story in Bedtime with Kanata. Good night, sleep tight, sweet dreams. Sleep well, everyone.